We are tracking a wildfire fight in Northern California. The latest fire burning in the Upper Tahoe National Forest near Soda Springs. The Royal Fire has burned more than 50 acres in tough, remote terrain. An evacuation warning has been issued for several homes on Soda Springs Road. Law enforcement is also evacuating recreation areas near the fire. Firefighters continue to work on containing the pay fire. It started Saturday afternoon near the Placerville Airport. The fire is at 77 acres at 25% containment. An evacuation order remains in effect for some areas of Texas Hill Road, as well as Dimmon Court and Pay Dirt Road. Battalion Chief Chris Vessel says crews will be on the fire for several more days, knocking out every hot spot as they deal with the extreme heat and changing conditions. Some of the firefighters that came here were recently released from the Thompson fire, and this is now their third different fire on a single deployment. They're already pre-tired from all these other fires that they've been dealing with. An overnight evacuation shelter has been set up at Union Mine High School, and people can take their pets to West Slope Animal Shelter in Diamond Springs. We're also learning now more about the damage left behind by the Thompson fire. That's Butte County. Cal Fire confirming the fire burned more than 3,000 acres, 3,700 acres actually, destroying 13 homes, damaging five more. It also destroyed some other small structures. The fire is now 98% contained. All evacuation orders and warnings have now been lifted. And we're tracking the French fire. That is burning near the town of Mariposa, east of Yosemite National Park. It's now over 900 acres, containment at 60%. The flames sparked on Thursday off of Highway 49 and French Camp Road. No exact numbers, but the flames did destroy some homes. Luckily, people were able to get out. We, of course, want to remind you, you can get the latest updates on the ongoing wildfires in our area. Download the free ABC 10 app wherever you get your apps.